Well, before I start answering the question, actually, it's my second time that I come to Saudi Arabia, and I'm really enjoying the country because it's a new culture, new people, and it's really, really interesting for me. So now I forgot what was the question. Remind Tell us me. about microdentistry. Yeah, microdentistry. Yes, that's why I'm actually here to share the philosophy, to share the approach. Microdentistry is um, actually minimally invasive approach in the treatment of the patient. It's when you control all the details much better, and with the less sacrifice, you can give people more advantages in the treatment. Okay, what got you interested in microdentistry? Well, you know, I've, when I was still in dental school, I was reading some books, I was uh, watching some videos, and I've seen people, how they work with the microscope. Uh, the first ones, people who started doing this in the beginning of the 90s, at the end of the 80s, and I was really, uh, I was really shocked the way how you can see the tooth, how you can see all the details. It's really, really cool. So this is how I actually started using the microscope in my practice. Okay, how does magnification affect your preparation? Oh, you know, I just can you I can tell you one thing. So when you see better, you can do it better. It doesn't matter what you do. You treat the tooth, you clean your house, you write a check, whatever you do. So of course, with the magnification, you can do every step of the treatment preparation provisional in much better, more precise way. So it changed your outcome of preparations drastically, you can say? Yeah, of course. I mean, guys, you can just go online, go to YouTube and just type teeth preparation. Uh, usually my video is second or first one in the list. So I think it has over 1 million views already. So you can just not listen to my words. You can just go ahead and watch the video. You will understand what I'm talking about. Do you have any advice for newly graduated dentists? Yes, first of all, never look for an excuse that you are so young. I mean, the age doesn't matter. Nowadays, I'm 29 and I'll be honest, I've visited already 40 countries with lectures and courses. I'm not trying to boast or something, I'm just telling you there are no limits. All the limits are inside of your head. So cancel them and you'll be successful. Thank you very much. Thank you.